Carrie Corbett Owen, and welcome to Coffee with Carrie and the reading of my book. For those of you following along, we're on page 50. Conscious Dying. Dorsey Peterson, at 105, still has too much to achieve to feel ready to die. She still has fun with the reporter, flirting as she plants a big kiss on his cheek. This is typical of a younger portal. When asked how she feels about her age, she jokes, The same as I felt when I was 16. What do you think? Do you think I'm old age? She follows this by mentioning a particular goal she's passionately working on and says once she's accomplished it, Then I'll go and die. That's what I have planned. Here's what she's telling her cells. I'm still young and attractive, and I can still do anything I please. I'm living life to the full, and I'll tell you when I'm ready to die. Dorsey is directing and controlling her body song and her biology. I have no doubt that once she's achieved her goal, if she is then ready to die, her cells will respond and she'll depart her body peacefully. I personally saw my one-time neighbour Pat in Napa command her body to die. It was 2008. I was visiting Napa, so I popped in to see Pat, who looked hale and hearty. Yet she told me she was dying. Surprised, I asked her what she meant. She told me she had cancer, but added that this wasn't what was going to kill her. She also had an inoperable growth in her air pipe, which would eventually block her breathing. She went on that all her children had stopped everything to be with her, but she felt they needed to go on with their lives. She didn't want them hanging around, waiting for however many months it would take for this growth to take her. So I've told my body it needs to die now, she said. One week later, she left her body quietly. We can command our body song for vibrant health, for disease and even death. So all of us that are worried about dying, what would happen if even now we started commanding our biology that we'll die when we're ready to, when we choose to, and that we'll die how we choose to. Because I've decided that I want to die just like my grandfather did, the one who was 101. He just went to bed quietly one night and slipped out of his human cloak. That's the way to do it. Subscribe to my YouTube channel, continue reading along with me, and don't forget to order my book off Amazon.